So I'm just going to go with this. So we got an extra medical tibial, tibial guide. And our left tibial cup block. And then a screwdriver in case they want to adjust, tighten it, or adjust the, the uh, medial cut. Then we got a 2 4 stylus or angel wing to check uh, posterior slope. Um, we got a bone rasp in case we got to do a few cleanup cuts. And then after that, we got to start with a size 8 uh, if we're doing a metal back. Eight. Size 8 because that's the lowest. Lowest. They have a metal back mm -hmm. tibia. Polys, size 8, uh, flexion extension gap. Um, and we got our size 5. Size 5. Left medial size five, or left medial distal block with a three four eight millimeter poly. And a hockey stick with a drop rod. To check our alignment. Then we got our posterior and chamfer block size 5 left medial with our lug punch or lug drill. Then we got our size 3 4 or our size 4 medial. Left medial um, tibial sizer. 34, 71, 91. And then we get our size 5 left medial femoral child with impactor. And size left medial 4 tibial base plate child with tibial impactor. And we got our size 3 4 tibial plug punch. And then other instruments we may need pin puller and slap hammer. Ta da! That's awesome.